Welcome back summoners, today I have a new app to review on the channel, stick around to learn about Itero and what it can do for your League of Legends gameplay. Itero is an overwolf app and it is a more simplistic version of pro comps. This app is meant to be a drafting tool for solo queue. Itero has a lot of great metrics at your disposal in the pregame so that you can make the best pick possible. Before I get down in the weeds, if this video helps you, go ahead and let me know by dropping a like, and if you want to see more, hit that sub button and leave a comment what app you want to see me talk about next. Itero is unique because it uses AI in order to predict what you should choose for solo queue, or at least that's what the developers claim. I haven't seen the source code and I have no idea if a neural net is actually used. However, Itero should be slapping me in the face saying pick Vi or dodge, and that is really all it should ever tell me. However, Itero has a lot of different metrics to show you. Because I'm a Vi one trick, I'm not using my main account for this because it would just be way too skewed. I doubt we would see anything interesting, so I'm playing on an account where I have less than 20 games played. Itero really emphasizes the simplistic and understandability of the app by displaying to you numerical metrics for what makes the best drafting selection. It can also take into account your mastery role, your bands, and who your team is picking or hovering. I really like that it gives multiple options because if your one trick gets banned then you're basically stuck scrambling to find a new champion and Itero gives you multiple champion options. As far as the accuracy of these goes, I don't really know what the criteria is for picking each champion. I think a lot of it depends on the meta and I think a good amount of it also depends on the playstyle and team comp depending on if you have that switch toggled. I think there are way too many ban options and that Itero should narrow it down to 5 or less using AI to determine who what is the most likely pick based on popularity and you're least likely to win against. Then again, I will just perma ban the clown and really don't care what anyone says about it. But no, enough from the clown. Huh? Using Itero, we can analyze the strengths and weaknesses of your champion as well as statistics for your champion which is where I think the real info really is, and you can also see who synergizes well or counters well. Let's talk about what these numbers mean. These ratings are between 0 and 5, 0 being the worst, 5 being the best, 2.5 being the average. Makes sense so far. Anything with an X in it is a multiplier for a percentage based on the given category. In simple terms, you want the highest numbers possible in every category. Now, before we all look at mine and collectively acknowledge that my ability to play is the liquid equivalent of dog water, this is my Finsta account. I mess around on this and rarely play it, so it makes sense that my numbers are bad. Now what the title is all about, I have messaged the Itero devs about what the future of Itero holds, and this app could very well be the future of third-party apps. The devs were withholding on the details for obvious reasons. What I'm talking about is Itero's phase one. The devs are building the AI concept to create an AI-based coaching tool that can evaluate players' accounts and give them pointers on where to improve. What phase two will entail, I do not know. It could range anything from like an OPGG review that you can buy from an experienced player on Skillcapped, or something like a Mobilitix GPI, or even a post-game breakdown. I think that it could be similar to that kind of post-game breakdown that I review on the channel, check out the other videos that I often cover. But I think this could be more in-depth by realizing what is really impacting your game and how to improve on it. This could be great for helping low elo legends improve. Now what I really hope that this AI can do. Like an app that tells me what to do, something like Czar where the AI tells you what to do in game, a full-on AI coaching for your decisions and giving you pointers and tips as you go. Basically like a really, really complex decision maker, but you know, helping you with League of Legends. The AI possibilities are endless with a concept. It could change the entire way that low elo is played. Or like think about two AI backed players going against each other, what that would be like, or even putting two AI bots against each other and making them ARAM. I'm just curious how that would end. I don't really know. And if someone's already done this, let me know in the comments down below because I want to see how that ends just for my own curiosity. Insert outro here. I didn't finish my script. <laughs>